Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Let's be real. My ideal spa moment is five minutes in the bathroom without my kids interrupting me. <laughs> But if I were to really have some me time, it would definitely look like this. So this video is in collaboration with four other ladies here on YouTube and they are Jeannie from Get This Glowing. She is so funny. Her channel is more of like a 50 plus channel on beauty and lifestyle. She does a lot of unboxings and just trying on makeup and reviewing makeup. And I love her because she is so funny, guys. If you get to know her and check out her channel, she has such a fun personality. I love her. And then one of my favorite unboxing ladies, she's Catherine from Catherine McCarty. She does a whole lot of unboxings from tea to skincare to beauty to lifestyle. Everything that you could think of in a subscription box, she has it. Everything proof beauty. I love her. I've recently collabed with Jessica on the Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty sale. She is all about facts. When you want to know more about a certain product, whether it's the ingredients or the reviews out there, for certain products she knows it she has it and then of course the star of the show this collaboration was put together by Vanessa Beauty I want to thank you Vanessa for inviting me into this wonderful collaboration I always have a special place in my heart for Vanessa because she's actually the first person that I ever collabed with on YouTube when I had the smallest channel I think I only had like 30 subscribers at the time what I love about her channel is that her channel is all about skincare from head to toe. This month is Vanessa's birthday month. Vanessa asked us if we could do a video on what an ideal spa day would look like for us. For me, I don't do a lot of spa-like days at home because my kids are young and they still demand a lot from me. Ideally, my first step would be a warm bath. Soaking in a bathtub, that warm bath generally includes like bath crystals or dead sea salts. I learned that sea salt baths have a very relaxing and soothing properties, especially when you have tired muscles or aching muscles, especially after a long day of work. That's exactly what your body needs. Your muscles need to relax. One of the products that I've tried is by the Ahava brand, which is the Ahava Natural Dead Sea Salt Bath. If I were to go the extra mile, I would definitely add roses, kind of like a rose petal bath. I actually brought in the roses as aesthetics, but I did a little bit more research and I didn't realize that there were so many great properties that rose petals can bring into your bath. It removes the feeling of anxiety, it helps you sleep better, it detoxifies your body, and interesting fact, it also relieves the itchy flaky areas of your scalp, which I struggle from that from time to time. It has such good benefits to add into your bath. So I love that. Next step would be masking. That's my go-to more than anything is just to put on a mask and soak and rest and just sit for a good 20 minutes or whatever the mask requires. And one of my favorite masks is this anti-wrinkle biocellulose mask from face story. If I were to think about a total spa experience, total relaxation experience, um, I would get a biocellulose mask or any of those coconut jelly-like masks because they're the ones that are most luxurious and feels most relaxing to me because they cling to your face like second skin and they're cold and cooling to the touch. I chose this mask also because this reminds me of Vanessa. We met through our love of Korean sheet masking and facestory.com was something we had in common at the time and even up to now. So let's go ahead and try that together. So this is a biocellulose mask developed with coconut water fermentation. It has marine collagen, one of my favorite ingredients to help tighten the skin. Jeju pure seaweed complex to help the skin turn over. It delivers active ingredients to skin evenly to help improve wrinkles. So I like to put the excess serum on my hands and on my elbows. And then this technique I learned from Vanessa using your favorite roller ball and roll it on top of the sheet mask. It's giving me the massage experience that I need. 
it helps push the serum or the ingredients even deeper into the skin. Just rolling this over my forehead is taking away the tension I have on my head. So let's go ahead and remove the mask. The serum is still so thick on the face and it's making my face like baby butt smooth. I forgot how much I miss these um, gel masks. I've been trying so many masks lately and I forgot how much I love them. So after masking, my ideal spa moment would be to have an eye patch on. One of the eye patches that I've tried is from Patchology. This one is so cute. I got this during 21 days of beauty sale. But Patchology is really a brand that's centered on bringing results fast kind of like their matte eye patches it's like a five minute eye patch routine i'm gonna go ahead and put one of these on and i like to go as close as i can to the under eye area It's so cooling on the eyes. I love it. This particular eye patch is for rejuvenation. It removes puffiness, dryness under the eyes, and it's a gel mask, so it really clings nicely. Um, it also has caffeine and collagen, which perks up the eyes. Caffeine improves the circulation and helps with dark circles. When I think of the collagen ingredient, you know, it just lifts everything under the eyes. Um, so that it gives you that refreshed and awake look. Definitely has that cooling sensation under the eyes, which I love. Whew. But while we're waiting for my eye patches to do its work and magic, um, let's go ahead and put on a hand mask. Now, this is something that I've tried several times with Sephora. I love their hand mask and foot mask if you guys haven't tried it. I don't know about the face mask, but I love their hand mask particularly. I've tried the aloe vera one, the one that's green, and they are ultra moisturizing and very hydrating, especially in the winter time. It made my hands so silky smooth all throughout the day it felt like i didn't even have to put lotion on so that was great um this one is the rose hand mask and this one has to do with moisturizing the hands to give it that soft and smooth look all of the sephora hand masks are vegan by the way it takes you 15 minutes the serum is inside these hands so this one is for the left it says it there Oh, it smells so good, guys. It smells like roses, so it's scented. And then you put that in, remove the sticker, and you just tighten the gloves around your, uh, your hands. The gloves is full of serum, guys. And just rub all of the serum in your hand. So let's go ahead and take the hand mask off. I don't know if there's a proper way to remove this, but I just tear it off. <laughs> I just had a thought. You can put the hand mask on, and so while you're masking, you can use this to clean the toilet and you're good to go. You know, you'll have a clean toilet and soft hands after. <laughs> the things I do to multitask, guys. And then this one, I can immediately tell that my dark circles are lessened. Like, I feel like my eyes are brighter. It looks like it's less puffy. So, oh, okay guys. <sighs> I am feeling so relaxed right now. You know, the next step would be to put on a moisturizer. So go ahead and pick your favorite moisturizer. For me today, it was the Caudalie moisturizer, but I have one secret ingredient that I have been loving lately, and this is Glossier's Future Dew Oil Serum. 
I rarely gravitate towards oils or oil serums. Most of my skincare are labeled oil-free, but I've made an exception because Glossier's Future Dew is actually an oil serum, but it's non-comedogenic. This is actually one of the most exciting launch in 2019 by Glossier. A lot of makeup artists raved about this. It has no shimmer. It's non-sticky. It looks like that. It is a little bit tinted. It's vegan, it's hypoallergenic, it's dermatologist tested, all of the good stuff, and it's plant-based. Basically, it gives you that glow that you want, that lasting glow that you would normally expect from your skincare. And this one kind of enhances and keeps that dewy finish on your skin all night long. And I love the feeling of it, guys. The oil is not sticky or greasy at all. And the next morning, my skin is so plump and healthy looking. And still it has that radiance, you know, that like glow from within kind of look. My face looks so much healthier, like it's had a good night's rest. So I would definitely end with this Glossier product as a last step to my spa experience. Oh, and one last thing, you can't forget lip gloss, right? I love a good lip gloss. This one that I have is from L'Occitane. <sighs> okay. I feel so zen and relaxed right now. I'm so glad I did this. And I'm so thankful for Vanessa for inviting me in this collaboration. It forced me to have this spa experience, this so needed spa experience at home. Um, we all need this, you know, especially during this trying times that we have. We definitely need to pamper and take care of our health, our mental health, but also our physical health as well. Find that special place that makes you happy, that makes you feel relaxed. That way you can handle anything that life throws at you. I definitely believe that self-care is not selfish. So keep that in mind whenever you find time for yourself, especially busy moms out there, caregivers, all of our doctors and nurses. Everyone does their part for this community. And so we really have to also remember to definitely give ourselves a break once in a while. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, this spa video. Um, if you'd like to try any of the items that I've tried today, they will be listed in the description box below. Definitely check out the other videos that I'm collabing with. Get This Glowing, Everything Proof Beauty, Katherine McCarty, and Vanessa Beauty. Everyone has a different skincare routine, a spa day routine, and I can't wait to watch their videos as well. We also have some kind of giveaway for my channel. I have a current giveaway right now, a face story face mask bundle, a set of seven masks, and a headband, a bunny headband from Face Story. And I thought this was very fitting to do a giveaway on it because that's how I met Vanessa. To enter into this Face Story bundle, you know, just comment, enter me in this video. And you can get two entries if you say, enter me on the other video, my Face Story video as well. So go check out this video right here. And that way you can have two entries. So. One in this spa collab video and another in the face story video that I, I have. just do a shout out and say happy birthday to Vanessa. Um, she has a major birthday giveaway there. So check her out. So that is it. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And if you're new here or if you are coming from all the other channels in this collaboration, Welcome, my name is Terry. I post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews. So please stick around, subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll definitely see you back in my corner soon. Bye.